Hi everyone, this is Nora and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be another review and in this video I'm actually reviewing some gel polishes which I'm really really excited about. Gel polishes does have another term and it's called shellac. I'm just gonna go ahead and use the term gel polish instead of using shellac because I find shellac is just a harder word to say it's a little bit more heavier so i'm just not going to say that i'm just going to refer to gel polishes and i'm really excited to show you guys these nail polishes as well i got a beautiful box from madame glam and i'm really 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 excited to show you guys the little colors that they sent me therefore if you're new here to my channel and you just stopped by to watch this review thank you so much for taking your time to watch my video it really 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 means a lot to me and if you haven't already please hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell to get notified every time i upload a new video it would really 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 mean a lot to me and I would love to have you guys aboard on the light family that I have here on my channel so therefore let's go ahead and show you guys the swatches and also the application for these colors right here I'm really excited and I really hope you guys enjoy it First of all, I really apologize for wearing a sweater today. It is a little bit cold today and it's rainy, so I just kind of wanted to fit the mood of the day today. So I do apologize just for wearing just a sweater. So I'm really sorry about that. But second of all, a huge thanks to Madame Glam for contacting me and sending me some of their gel polishes to try. And I'm really, really, really excited to show you guys the colors and also the application on how you can achieve beautiful nails that could last you for about a week even two weeks it all depends on yourself i'm going to be talking more about it they were also really nice enough to provide me with a discount code for you guys they actually provided me with a 30 percent discount for you guys please use code beauty by nd30 i will leave all of the information down below for you guys same thing to the colors as well so i'm really really excited to show you guys what they have sent me so they sent me this beautiful little box i love the black and gold details on it i've been really really into it lately and it's madame glam new york and it says everything you love at your fingertips which is so cute i can't wait to show you guys what they gave me so it says hello gorgeous right here honestly like the reason why i like to show you boxes is just because i'm a packaging freak i love that so i like to kind of share that little touch with you guys as well so and then when you open it up it comes like this so you guys can see the so when you open the box it does come with a sponge right here so it can protect your polishes and these are the colors that they sent me that they sent me three of their colors and also their famous top coat and base coat as well and when i saw this baby right here i was so excited you guys have no idea and they were so nice enough to send me their mini uv led lamp and i love the fact that this is mini because it's great for traveling you guys like i am just I was really really excited you guys are going to see me use this in the video i do have little clips of each color that you're going to see them in detail and also show you the application and how to put them on to be honest with you guys let me just put this down here for a second and just talk to you guys about gel polishes if you guys don't know i studied into manicure and pedicure which i kind of became a nail technician i studied into it and if you go back in time in my videos i took you guys on a vlog to set up my own nail station at home when I was with my parents but unfortunately I don't do nails anymore I just found the path of being a nail technician wasn't really for me and then it happens that you study into something that it's not yours so I just decided to kind of pursue what I really love which is makeup and microblading and this is what I do right now but therefore to say I have discovered gel polish when I was in nail school and after I discovered that you can just cure it with an LED light I was like throw away all my nail polishes and just renew and stock up on gel polishes and since then I've been just using only that so I don't have any more nail polishes and I don't have to deal with acetone except removing the shellac but that's all I do and honestly Honestly, I have to say it's much cleaner and it lasts longer and you don't have to sit there and wait till it dries just an LED light to cure it and then you're good to go that's all we need for this process especially I'm somebody I just don't have patience to sit there and kind of till it dries I don't have time for that 
Therefore, when I saw Madame Glam contacting me, I was blown away because I've been keeping an eye on some of their gel polishes and when they contacted me, I was like really, really, really excited. So thank you so much Madame Glam for sponsoring this video and also this review. Thank you so, so, so much. So I'm really excited to show you guys the colors right here. First of all, let me show you the LED light. I think this is the most exciting thing in here. <laughs> other than the colors to be honest because this is so handy like i said for traveling it's an amazing size it comes in a cute box and it comes like that it does have a usb plug so you definitely need to have a wall plug for it if you have an iphone or whatever you can just go ahead and use that plug this is what i normally do i put it in my little skull right here so you kind of need one like that to just add the usb in and you're kind of like good to go so just just an fyi and then you have the cutest little lamp ever they do have it in pink and in white and i love the fact that they sent me a white because it kind of goes with my aesthetic so you kind of see the lights right here so all of these yellow little dots or squares these are the lights so this opens up like this so it can perfectly sit on your table like so and this is the one that is connected with the usb and you have the little button right here which is the on button that you click to work you guys will see in a second on how this works but honestly it's just the cutest little thing ever and it cures your nails very 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 well in this box i also have their famous top coat and base coat and honestly i love them so much it works very very well i do have the base coat on top coat on my nails today you can see the shine that it gives like this is the top coat you guys and the shine on it is just incredible this is why i love gel polish in general just the shine that the top coat gives you like an actual nail polish top coat doesn't really give you that within the days i will talk about how well they stay on as well in this video and hopefully this will kind of give you like an estimate on how long gel polish could stay on your nails but yeah i love their packaging it looks like that really cute and this is how it looks like obviously they're both transparent so you don't really have a color on top let me go ahead and show you guys quick quick the brush you will see the brush also in details later on but this is how the brush looks like and gel coats normally are they do have like a sticky feeling to it i don't know if you guys can see that but the brush is just a regular nail polish brush that you have and it's so easy to use one thing i would recommend you if ever you're going to be using the led lamp here is just not to get it super close to the polishes because you just don't want them to cure in the bottles because that could happen even though the bottle is always dark for that reason but just to stay on the safe side if ever you're curing your nails with the lamp just make sure it's kind of far away from the bottles if ever you are planning to get a color from them i would highly recommend that you also get the base coat on top coat it will really complete your nail look so highly recommend them and if ever you're wondering on how to remove gel polishes please let me know in the comments down below and i'll be more than happy to do that video um it's quite simple the way i do it is really not that complicated it does take a little bit more time but i will explain all of that in that video if ever you do want me to create it um, i do have a simple way for you to remove your gel polishes so if ever you're interested let me know in the comments down below i'll be more than happy to do that video for you guys next it is the famous colors that they have sent me they were really nice and generous enough to give me three colors over here they did contact me and tell me we're gonna send you bright colors but if you guys know i'm not really a super bright person um i love pastels a lot and the only bright color that i would wear is probably red and i really like dark colors as well the black color white is one of my favorites too to wear on my nails i love burgundies i love deep plum colors when it comes to the fall i love nudes all shade of nudes i love it so i'm just who i am and they were really nice enough to send me what i felt comfortable with and i just really really appreciate it so thank you so much for doing that so they ended up sending me a red one i love red nail polish and this one is super pretty on i will show you guys in a second next they also sent me this kind of like a light lilac color you do have the color on top right here as well but what i found about this one it is quite sheer so i did use it in a way in the video you're going to see that looked absolutely fabulous and just on its own it kind of looks like your natural nail color but with the gloss on top which i 
really 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 like so this is quite more on a sheer side and the red one is more on the opaque side even though it's opaque i like to use at least two coats of this just to really have a strong red color this one right here i probably use two to three coats just to kind of have the color stand out a little bit more but honestly i just love this one so much i'm probably going to be wearing it a lot on its own as well when i just don't feel like wearing any nail color um so this one is one of my favorites last but not least is this one i have to say i love toppers a lot anything with like a glitter topper i really really like it a lot so this one is exactly that it looks more on a nude side but this one also has a sheer look. I feel like two coats of this, it really kind of brings out a little bit of the nude color. Obviously, if you add three coats of this, then you will definitely see the nude color. But this one, as a first coat, you can definitely just see more of the glitters. I know I have black nails on, but I did add this as a topper on top of my black nails. And I'm just going to show you how it looks like. So you see that little glitter effect that i have on my nails right now this is the nude polish from madame glam and i absolutely love it um as you guys all know i love black a lot black is probably one of my favorite colors to wear on my nails and the fact that i can disguise it with a glitter topper like that it just it just makes it perfect for me and I love it so you can definitely use this as a topper on top of any color that you want it will give you a nice glitter finish and that's why I really wanted to kind of feature one of the nail polishes on my nails today as a topper so you guys could kind of get an idea but you will also see it on its own now i'm gonna start off with this color right here the nude color what i would recommend you to do before applying any gel polish you want to make sure that your nails are nicely and clean meaning cuticles are pushed out they're cut out your nails are filed to the way you want them to be you want to make sure that you have a clean surface before applying any gel polish so when you do that start off with the base coat a little thin coat of base coat that's all you need the one thing with gel polish especially when it comes to base coat and top coat you definitely need to do a super super thin coat of this because if you add too much especially the base coat is that your actual gel color won't stick on properly you will see it kind of like bubble up on like certain areas just because you have added a lot of base coat to start off with so start off with a really 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 thin coat to base coat is to kind of really soak out the brush from the product and then apply it on your nails meaning drain all the product that you have on your brush before applying it on your nails and honestly the reason why they say that is because this is what lasts your gel polish on your nails now i'm somebody who washes her hands often i cream my hands all the time so for me the time base for my gel polish is about a week because my hands are always wet they're always creamed out because i tend to get dry skin a lot on my hands especially in the winter time it's even worse so for me normally it stays about a week but if you're somebody who wears gloves and you take care of your nails and all of that then this could last you for about two weeks and two weeks for gel polish is a very good time i have to say that the nude one it lasted like for about two weeks the red one for me was about a week and then the nude one was about a week and a half so honestly like i'm somebody who always changes her nail color and i change my nail color every week just because i like to have a fresh look so that is just my personal opinion but you can go ahead and try it out it can even last longer on you so after you apply the base coat you just cure it the what i love about this lamp it does have its own timer so once you put it on you wait till it really cures your base coat and then once it's turned off then you're ready to go ahead and use the color so the first color you guys are seeing right now is the nude color right here and i love love this one obviously you guys could see from the first quote there isn't really much going on but you can definitely see the glitters that this color has and it's just so pretty so i ended up curing it when the light turned off i ended up putting my second quote 
and then after that I just added a little bit of a dimension on the nail with a little brush and I used a white so it kind of looked like I had a French tip and I just loved this finish this was perfect for me because I had an engagement party and um, this was just the perfect look on my nails I found it so elegant and super cute if you guys don't want to add the white line feel free to not do that I feel like just on its own it was absolutely stunning as well this nude topper is called the Winston if ever you are wondering I will leave all of the information and links of the colors down below for you guys so it would be easier for you to find it if ever you liked any of the colors that I'm showing you in this review next color is the little lilac sheer color right here this one is called bloom and I have to say I love this color so much as you guys could see I did use the base coat like normal and once the light turned off I started using the bloom color and bloom is a very sheer sheer color so the first coat that you're going to apply on you won't really see any color because it's made like that I feel like this color would be really nice for a French tip so I had to add at least two quotes or three quotes of this I don't really remember I do apologize you can definitely see a little hint of lilac in there but it was quite sheer so I decided to add just on my ring finger some silver glitter ombre and I loved how it looked like I wish like I did all my nails like that but I really wanted to just feature the color on its own on the rest of my nails so just to give you guys an idea but some doing something like that like an ombre effect or even a french tip it looks absolutely beautiful so i really loved the finished look and obviously i topped everything off with the top coat same thing as the nude one and i just absolutely loved the finish last but not least it is the red shade i loved this color to be honest with you guys my husband always loves when i wear red nail polish there's something about red that he just loves on me he always tells me please do your toes red please do your nails red and every time I tell him I'm doing my nails he's like what are you doing them red because <laughs> he just loves it so much because I think when we first met I had red nails on and he kind of just fell in love with how it looked on me he always tells me to wear red nail polish same thing with red lipstick he loves when I wear red lipstick so red I guess it's his favorite color <laughs> so this red right here as a first quote obviously i use the base coat for this one as well but as a first quote with this red one it's highly opaque and it's so pigmented so you can definitely go ahead without using a second quote i have been saying quote but it's quote coat second coat there you go <laughs> but using a second quote <laughs> But if ever you do want to make it vibrant, second coat of this one will definitely bring out the red. And I feel like it kind of made it more on like a reddish burgundy side, which I kind of liked. But definitely just a one coat of this one um, will definitely just do it. You don't really need to apply a second one. I have to say this is such a pretty red. It's actually the prettiest red I've used so far no joke and i love the fact that it also give you the color up here as well on the bottle i find it so cute so if you guys are wondering about what's the name of this red one this is called amour and amour means love in french so i love this one it's just the perfect name for it it's just so elegant and so classy i love this color so much that i did not do anything with this one i just kept it as it is because it's just so beautiful on its own but definitely if ever you want you can definitely add the new topper on top for valentine's day or anything like that if you want to be a little bit more on the spicy side i would definitely highly recommend you to do that i think these two together would be so beautiful as always i topped this one up with the top coat as well i really hope you guys kind of got a good idea on how the colors look and how the lamp works so that is it i hope you guys enjoyed this review i absolutely love the colors hopefully i'll get the chance to work with more colors in the future and if i do i will definitely be filming videos for you guys about them i mean every time you see me 
doing tutorials on one art and if I'm using any of Madame Glam nail polishes on myself then I will let you know. I love to do my nails when I do my videos. I feel like it just an extra accessory for me. Just, just kind of completes me. I love nails. I love gel polishes a lot. I just can't go without a day having something on my nails. I have to. Same thing as my toes. My toes are always painted as well. <laughs> so there you have it guys. This is my review. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, also gave you guys a little bit of an idea on how to use gel polishes. If ever you do need to have a one-on-one -on -one video on how to apply gel polishes, please feel free to let me know in the comments down below and I'll be more than happy to do that for you guys. Really hope you guys like the colors and how I applied them on and kind of gave you guys an idea on how to work with gel polishes. Therefore, thank you guys so much for watching. I want to wish you guys a wonderful day. Thank you again to Madame Glam for sending me your beautiful shades. I had a lot of fun using them and I can't wait to use them more in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye!